G'day guys, welcome back. Hopefully everyone has had a great weekend. Uh, today we're going to look at Kendall. I don't know if you've heard of Kendall yet, uh, but it's phenomenal. It's uh, been currently uh, developed and it's fully planned out and you're going to hear a lot more about it in the community over the coming weeks, months and uh, years ahead. First of all, it's uh, totally decentralized uh, on the blockchain and it's on the Ethereum blockchain. And what you can do is then go ahead and use your wallet, uh, your MetaMask wallet or whatever wallet you use to be able to connect to this uh, new social media. This uh, social media empowers you to become the frontline person and to build your community. Uh, in example, uh, you get to share in uh, the revenue that this social media uh, earns. Uh, every bit of revenue will go through the uh, blockchain and therefore there will be like a downpipe of uh, rushing water into your little uh, uh, empowering uh, yourself in your little social uh, pool that you'll be creating. And uh, guys, I'm going to pass you over to uh, the leadership team uh, and uh, the leadership team here is uh, is amazing and uh, and we look forward to being able to share this with you so turn in the actions into passions that's the uh, headline of the uh, of uh, the the protocol here and let's go ahead and uh, watch the presentation of uh, the leadership giving uh, the oversight uh, and the insight and uh, please go ahead, smash the bell and uh, subscribe. And we look forward to being able to connect with you further and also reach out and comment there. Okay. All right. Welcome, everyone, to this first webinar that I'm doing about a decentralized social media platform that is about to be launched very, very soon. It's on the blockchain. And... In this webinar, I'm going to share with you all the details how you can benefit from being part of this social media revolution and how you can earn massive residual income for years to come and how you can benefit from the early pre-sale before the platform is actually going live. And I'm going to share with you how it is actually very, very natural that the next progression in our evolution is happening with the smart contracts and social media that is working fully on the blockchain. So let's get started. Uh, we're talking about Kandao, where for the first time you are part of a new generation of social media and you can be the first to benefit from every single advertisement, every single piece of content somebody creates, every single transaction, every single person, you can be part of it, which has never been done before, guys. We know that the crypto adoption is right now going in rapid speed all around the world. It's kind of like in the beginning of the internet when the first website showed up and computers became better, the internet uh, became faster. And we can see that uh, our crypto users, the adoption is going hand in hand with the early stages of the internet. So we are right now, if you can uh, imagine 23 years ago when the internet just got started to becoming more popular, how quickly it grew and how social media platform that launched uh, more than 15 years ago, Facebook, has been able to amass billions and billions of users uh, because of the internet. Well, right now we have the exact same opportunity because the whole world is moving into crypto. And moreover, all of the businesses are going to be in crypto sooner or later. Every single project, every single business, little coffee shops, little restaurants, hotels, everything is going to go on the blockchain sooner or later. Everything will be tokenized. And even people, me and you, everyone, 
will have their own token. So that's the direction the world is going. And those startups, those uh, companies that understand that you got to be ahead of the trend and you got to be really the one delivering on this all these beautiful innovative solutions that the blockchain technology allows us to to do is really paving the way uh, for this revolution so what we have in social media is a huge market is a huge opportunity guys uh, the market dominance here is basically 4.6 billion users worldwide right if you can talk about uh facebook instagram TikTok, twitter people are doing every single day they're logging into social media they are commenting they're messaging each other they're creating groups they're creating videos you know they're socializing they're spending an average of two and a half hours a day using social media Right now, the 4.6 billion users worldwide, and it's growing by 10% year on, year out. So the whole world is connected to the internet, to social media. People like to socialize. We are social creatures. And this is obviously a huge market. Now, how we're going to compete against the current platforms, against those giants, by innovation and unprecedented advantages. So we have huge problems with the social media that we use today. Uh, the main problems is monopolistic position. Like all of these big companies, they're pretty much monopoly. They're pretty much uh, holding the keys and the data of all of the users. And they're centralized, which means that basically they control who is going to do what they can block accounts if they want to they can censor like what happened to andrew tate for example they they block his social media account along with all of his followers it's outside of the control of every individual users be it youtube be it uh, twitter instagram facebook doesn't matter they have the power uh they're controlling the personal data and what are you are what are you getting from all of this billions of dollars that these companies are generating basically nothing <laughs> we the users are providing the content we are providing all of this data and facebook or instagram or all these platforms they are getting all of this revenue to themselves we're getting nothing out of it yeah, but because we are creating the content because we are uh, having this providing this data that they control they can sell this data to different businesses and advertisers and collect all of this ad revenue which is into billions and billions and billions of dollars and the users do not get anything out of it so um Kandao is going to change all of that where you essentially have full control over your your data full control over your content and you can share all of the advertising revenue in the platform and moreover than that you can immediately monetize your content immediately sell it to your followers right away get paid in your wallet immediately so this is something that has never been a possible before but with the new technologies we can make social media exciting again right now it's kind of boring people are nothing really changed in the last 10 years in in, in facebook very little changes uh but this is going to disrupt how people really treat social media and want to what they want to get out of social media we are transitioning guys into a world of web 3.0 it's no longer about emails and passwords and uh basically all this centralized data we are moving into the blockchain space where everything is verifiable on the blockchain and the data can be trusted finally so we have a situation where in social media that we exist today 
there are a lot of fake accounts. How many of you guys have encountered a situation where somebody creates an account and impersonate this account as you? I know it happens to me all the time. People message me, is, is this is you that is messaging me right now? Like, no, this is not me. <laughs> somebody creates a fake account and that's a huge problem that exists today, be it Instagram, be it Facebook, lots and lots of fake accounts. And we cannot trust the data. We cannot trust that somebody puts on the profile, you know, that I am working in Microsoft or I'm doing this and that. It's just somebody, you know, that, that writes in their profile, but how can we really trust it? Well, the world is about to really get reborn in this era of trust and how we define trust and, and, and what we really trust and who we trust because of the blockchain. So what Kandao is building is a decentralized networking with the blockchain and building a decentralized neural community using a CDO as a fuel. CDO is their token. Uh, and we already have the prototype of this social media platform uh, actually already in review by App Store right now. And what you are about to see, some of the uh, designs of the user interface and how it's going to look like is what we are already going to see in the first phases of the rollout. But imagine a situation where you actually own the private keys to your followers. So you build your following once, you have all these followers connected to you, and they're connected to you on the blockchain with a wallet. So no matter what happens, they are with you and you own this data. You own those followers because they're connected to you on the blockchain. No social media company can take it away from you, block your account, censor you, move you out, and you lose data to all of these followers. Never again is going to happen because of what Kandao can do and how this technology works. You own your followers on the blockchain. You own every piece of content that you create the, uh, you know, and, and on the blockchain. In fact, every reel and every post and every story, every video, you can turn into NFT instantly and store it on the blockchain. So whatever we are already used to, the best features of the social media platforms, being, being it the stories and reels and um, you know, videos and video calls and, and group calls and all of these things, they modeling the best features that has been created on social media platforms that we love. They're going to have all of these things inside of Kandao social media platform. So we already used to it. We already know it. We already love it. But a big difference is you own the content. And only you own the content. Nobody can mess with it, delete it, censor it, and you can actually monetize it and you can actually sell it right away into your wallet. Because with the Kandao, the way you log in, you actually have a crypto wallet with crypto assets in it, uh, in your social media uh, platform. So everyone that log logins, they log in with their crypto wallet, with a web free login. It's as simple as that. You connect your MetaMask, for example, or other wallets uh, via Wallet Connect, okay? And boom, you don't need the username, you don't need the password. That's how you connect. Now, one very, very important key feature of the social media platform is an on chain ID. For the first time, we can actually verify individuals and store that verification on the blockchain. Every person in the social media platform is going to have their NFT created. There's going to be a couple of different NFTs based on how much this person can be verified. If they do the full KYC, full face ID verification, then they're going to receive the highest level of uh, on-chain ID that can be fully trusted. So no more fake profiles. With this on-chain ID, 
In fact, every person uh, receives a digital identity on the blockchain. And now we can talk about the launch pads, the different projects that want to raise capital. They have team members. Now, how are we going to verify those team members? Before, we need to go to LinkedIn. We need to go to you know, search for this information. Who is this team member? What has they have done in the past? You know, what is their track record? What are his capabilities? Well, all of this information can be faked and it's very hard to verify and trust it. Well, think about a future. Well, every person has an identity on the blockchain with a full track record history of what he has done, what company he worked for, that it can be trusted and verified on the blockchain, verified by the companies themselves. So no longer can somebody claim, oh, I've been working in Microsoft. Yeah, prove it that you've been working on Microsoft, right? So Microsoft can verify, yes, this person worked in Microsoft from this time to this time, and it's on the blockchain. So now, people can trust who are the team members that are leading the projects. It's going to be much less situations of projects fail or different scams because the team members can be verified on the blockchain. So you earn from all the processes with Fuel CDO. Let's go further. The Matchify feature allows people to connect and co-create with people around them based on the roles, based on what they like, based on who they are. So there's, the, there's a built-in function there where you can actually see who are the people around you that have the interest that you, that you want and the roles that you want. Let's say that you want to meet developers in your area. So you can see who are these developers and uh, even where, where they are located. And you can create a, a, a public meeting group, for example, and you can invite those people, uh, you know, maybe for an interview or collaboration or whatever. It's a new world to collaborate, a new way to co-create and create different groups that are powerful because they share the similar roles. You can identify what roles are you playing in the ecosystem. Are you a programmer? Are you a developer? Are you an entrepreneur? Are you an influencer? What is your role? And you can identify other people with similar roles. Now, here's the big, big idea that is absolutely game changer. When I saw that and the possibility that it creates, it absolutely blew my mind. So right now, you see influencers, uh, for example, Andrew Tate or Kardashians or uh, Ronaldo or Messi, you know, we have a lot of these uh, influencers, celebrities, uh, millions of people are searching for them on the internet. Now they, they went viral, they're very popular, but are we actually benefiting from all of this popularity? Absolutely not. We are not. The influencers, how do they, earn on social media today? Well, they have to rely on advertising revenue. So if they're on YouTube, one way they can earn on YouTube is YouTube gives them the uh, basically a, a portion of the advertising they generate because they have this video on YouTube. Yeah, that's mainly what how influencers on YouTube are generating income or they have to basically send people from social media platform to other website when, when they have an offer, when they are selling something. Uh, same thing on Facebook or Instagram. In order to profit, you need to take people outside of Facebook or outside of Instagram in order for them to benefit. Like They need to click and go away from social media and, and buy something outside. Well, for the first time ever, every person can actually be tokenized. 
every person with a couple clicks of a button can actually create their social token, which is like a value of a person on the social media platform. So you can see a picture here as an example. Let's say it's Andrew Tate, and you can see the price of his token, how many holders he has, what's his market cap, what's the supply, what's the price change in the last 24 hours, in the last seven days, in the last 30 days. Every person can create their own token. Even if you have zero knowledge in code, you don't understand nothing about crypto, you're just a regular person, couple clicks of a button, and you'll be able to create systematically. Everyone can create their own social token. So in this way, you can participate in the success of others or create your own value and earn from every process with buying and selling. So think about it for a second. Let's say that uh, Ronaldo or Messi, they just start their own account here and they launch their own social token. Would you want to be one of the first people that buy their social token? Of course you would, because you know many other people are gonna come and they're gonna buy this token. It's gonna increase in value significantly. That's one way how you'll be able to monetize this by buying the social token and actually participate in the success of others. Let's see. Let's say you you know you have a singer and you love this singer and you love the, their song. So you know that other people are going to also love it too. And as his career as a singer is going to be uh, expanding, uh, more projects, more revenues. This person can actually share the revenue from these projects with his followers who bought his social token. If you are Ed Sheeran, and you are a singer, and you have a concert, and you have a, a identity on a social media platform, you have a social token. So now, all of a sudden, all these singers, influencers, musicians that have followings, they can instantly start monetizing their followers just like that, because people will buy directly the social token because they already have their wallet. They already have their crypto wallets in the social media platform. They don't need to do basically anything other than like, okay, I, I want to buy the social token of this person and, and they buy. Everything is happening via smart contracts. They don't need to worry about liquidity and all of that. They solve all of these issues. And somebody can buy at one time and sell another time. It's all working automatically. So this is very powerful way how influencers can monetize. But moreover, if you invite, invite an influencer to this platform, you can actually benefit and earn a percentage of all of this activity happening around the social token of an influencer. So that creates a situation where the influencers are going to be fighting who is coming first to the platform and capture more of the market share because if I'm an influencer and I invite you first, even if this person is also following other influencer, only once you can connect by somebody who's going to invite you to the social media platform and you are linked to them forever with all of the activity. So, of course, if you are a fan of different musicians, you, you like different artists, but one artist is going to invite you to the platform first. Now, you're going to be connected to this artist forever for uh, whatever you do in social media platform. This musician, this artist is going to benefit. So that will create this kind of competition for the influencers to get involved as soon as possible. And why they'll get involved? Because they will earn more money, plain and simple. Being in Kandao social media platform, they'll earn more money without being censored, without 
having any kind of issues and they'll benefit directly from their followers and fans. Then there's brands. So basically any business, any restaurant, any hotel, any company, any offline business, they can have their own brand token. And they'll, by you buying their brand token, you can benefit from discounts for promotions, etc. And if you invite your followers to buy this brand token, so you can also benefit from it. It's all interconnected, right? That's a major way how I can see these companies, these brands, these restaurants, etc. They can tokenize themselves in a very easy way, and it can go mainstream. So instead of having a Facebook page for the brand, why not have a Kandao page and then have instantly your own token that people can buy and you can benefit from it and you can also give discounts and promotions. So that's a new way of how the economy can start functioning. So we see a situation where Binance have earned over $22 billion through transaction fees. And they have 200 million users. Those are the speculators, the investors who are uh, basically want to buy and sell crypto uh, on Binance Exchange. This billions of dollars just through those, just through the fees alone. Then there is Facebook that earns for advertising approximately $23 billion in 2022. So billions of dollars are there, but we as users, we are not getting anything out of it. So we have we'll have the power of these types of billions of dollars in transaction fees, in advertising, but this time shared to the users. That's the that's the big idea that we can benefit from the activities of each other. So the Kandal liquidity pool is where all of these funds are directed, portions of them, right? So all the transactions, all the advertising, the buying and selling, the swapping, the tokenization, everything. A, a portion of that goes to Kandal liquidity pool. So for for any given amount, to give you an idea, let's say 60% can go to the influencer, to the person, to, to you. 20% will go to Kandao company, out of which 35% will go to buy back CDO token on the exchange. And 20% will go to the network. They have the concept called a multi-level network, where you can actually have all of your network that you invite and they invite, they all connected through the blockchain to you. And you can earn a piece of all the transaction fees that all of this user, all of this network that you helped to build and invite into the platform, you can benefit from it as a form of residual income. Imagine in your app, a notification, you earn $3, you earn half a dollar, you earn five dollars all day long like literally all day long having those small little transaction fees notifying you that you earn you earn you earn you earn because you have millions of people that are connected to your network and because of that every single day your wallet is bombarded with micro transaction fees that's what we can do here guys so right now what is happening is we have the pre-sale of the priority passes. So basically there is a, 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 a token generation event that is happening in June, around June. So in summer, this is like four months from now, uh, where the token will be generated, listed on a decentralized exchange.
like Uniswap or PancakeSwap, for, for example. And what is happening now is that we get the chance to grab these tokens before it is going live, before it is actually the, the platform fully launches. I mean, it's going to be a beta, of course, where you don't will not expect to see all the features on day one. It's not possible. If you can remember Facebook in day one, it was totally different than what it is right now or, or Instagram. But we're going to have the wallet. We're going to have all this network. We're going to have on-chain ID. And throughout this year will be the release of the basic functionalities that we all uh, basically need is like video posting, a live going live stream, you know, uh, stories and reels and all of that. So all will happen throughout this year. But right now, you can build your network. You can already build your network connected to your MetaMask wallet. You can already have this network before even the app is in the app store yet. So think about that. When, when, when people log in into their decent, decentralized social media application to start engaging, they already will, will be connected to you forever in their wallet. They're already be connected to you. And whatever they do, whatever their activity, they will forever be connected to. So this opportunity is in a very early stage right now as the full uh, two and a half billion, uh, this is the hard cap, two and a half billion uh, CDOs, uh, 500 million CDOs will be available for the pre-sale. Now, this is the only way where the CDO is going to be uh, basically uh, been able to be purchased. There is no other launch pad. There is no other website. You can go to buy CDO. It's only uh, here on the official Kandao website. That's it. The only way to get CDOs. Now, those CDOs will be able to stake and those people that stake CDOs will also earn from, uh, from the fees, from the advertising, from all these revenues that this platform can produce like launch pads, uh, people can raise capital, raise funds inside the marketplace. There's so many things that people can do inside of the Kandao, how they plan it. So a portion of all of that activity will be going to reward the stakers of CDO. And CDO will be required for everything. It's like a fuel in Kandao ecosystem. Whatever you want to do, you will need CDOs. To do it, period. So uh, this is the priority pass. It is going to be already available for pre-booking, for pre-depositing on the 6th of March. And the pre-sale is going to start on the 20th of March. So those are the priority pass packages that you see here. And with the priority pass package, you can actually have the CDO tokens that comes along with it. You can have already your web 3.0 domain. So the domains of the future are not going to be .com and .net. The domains of the future are domains that have just the name. Just the name and that's it. It's a web 3 domain. It's a different type of domain and the websites that already you know understand this they only only build web3 uh, no other way to interact only with web3 so you'll be able to get your own domain name and of course the social wallet so it starts with uh, 150 dollars basically 159 dollars if you count the fees uh, the priority pass packages and it goes according to the table so it starts with four cents. So the four cent is the minimum price that CDO can be purchased on the beginning of the pre-sale on day one. Okay. 
So what you can see here is the full table. So this is how it's going to go. On the four cent price, there is a pool of $7,500. So the moment the $7,500 is going to be purchased, four cents automatically not available anymore. It's going to jump to four cents oh five. Okay, where additional $7,800 pool will be available. So I believe it can be filled within the first, you know, 10 seconds, five seconds of the launch of when it's going to go live. Then it's going to jump to 0.041 uh, cent and 0.0415. And as the pool becomes higher, every time the pool becomes higher and the price jumps just a little bit more. So you can see that when we scroll down, right here the majority of the funds are going to be generated here is a pool of two hundred and fifty thousand dollars for example on 9.4 cents okay then there is a pool of four hundred ten thousand dollars almost on 10 cents then we scroll down here a million dollar pool at 14 uh 14.3 cents then finally, as the, the, the millions of dollars are going to be anywhere from 14 cents to 20 cents, right, for the remaining like months, months and a half of uh, promotion of the pre-sale. And then it's going to be a token generation event. The token generation event is going to be happening at the price of 21 cents. So this is the price where it's going to be listed on an exchange when the listing is going to be happening from there of course people buy then it can go from 20 cents to 30 cents or whatever the the price is going to go on the exchange but you will have the opportunity to get it uh at those prices at, at five cents at six cents you know at those prices four cents and even you'll have the opportunity for some people, for some action takers, actually even below this price on a limited quantity, you'll be able to get it as low as 2.8 cents, okay? Uh, so that is limited though, uh, but and both in how many people can be able to get it and you will need to qualify for it also. And also how much money you can get it at 2.8 cents. But some people for limited money will be able to also get it as low as 2.8 cents, 3 cents, 3.6, okay? Uh, so, but very limited people. Again, that's maximum 500 people and uh, the maximum amount is $5,000 uh, for those that qualify. But here is where it all will start at 4 cents for the pre-sale. And the token generation event will, will be at 21 cents. So this is like very early on uh, that we basically they're raising $75 million in total. Uh, if everything will be fulfilled, all the pools, uh, the maximum $75 million of the total event of the pre-sale. Okay. Uh, then there is uh, the marketing plan. So uh basically in my friends when they met the founders that was a couple of weeks ago uh and they didn't have this in mind but they did convince them to add some juice into the sale that they are planning and add a little bit of a uni level plan here so people have the incentive to build a network in in a better way so there is actually five levels of the union level that will be available uh starting with 10 percent on the first level then six percent on the second four percent three percent and two percent and this can also be slightly increased based on the uh turnover basically so you can see over here there's going to be real-time pools available so uh, the first pool in USDC up to $700,000 will be available for the top three people that actually make the, the most, uh, basically, sales, okay? So each will get 
uh, up to $230,000, something like that. Then the next five people will share $200,000 pool and 10 people will share $140,000 pool. And then on the CDO side, because beside the priority pass packages, people can also buy CDO additionally, right? So uh, the, the, the first three people will be sharing 5 million CDO, then another five uh, people will share 1.5 million CDO and another 10 people will share 1 million CDO. But on top of that, there is an early birds bonus. So the first 50 people will get 30% extra CDO on, uh, on their purchase, 50 to 100 people, 20% extra, and then 5% extra. So this, this can go quickly, but here's a special pass, and this is based on turnover. So uh, basically, if your turnover is $100,000, you get additional 50,000 CDO on top, and if your turnover exceeds two hundred thousand dollars, you actually get four percent on top of each level. So instead of ten percent, you'll get fourteen percent. Instead of six percent, you'll get ten percent. Instead of four percent, you'll get eight percent, seven percent, and six percent on the unit level when you reach two hundred thousand dollar special uh, two hundred thousand dollar turnover, a special pass. And also, uh, there'll, there's an NFT collection of them and these nfts will give different basically things in the kandao ecosystem maybe higher staking rewards or uh, lower transaction fees or stuff like that so there is a limited collection of those nfts that will be also uh given out so uh basically they they already have several influencers uh, confirmed to be part of this um, social media platform. One of them, I'm sure you know this guy, uh, his name is uh, Kabi Lame. Uh, this is his profile on Instagram, right there. Uh, 80 million followers on Instagram and 154 million followers on TikTok. So, uh, he met with the founders, he met uh, with the team and uh, they're fully on board. And there is another like 100 million followers uh, between the other social media uh, influencers that love this project and love this idea and what's, what's happening. They, they want to be on board, right? Uh, they speak with uh, Andrew Tate as well. So other influencers, I cannot tell you the other names yet, but I know this, I've seen personally uh, how the founders uh, met with uh, this guy. So the, yeah, so this is pretty much uh, uh, confirmed, okay? And many more follow influencers will, will follow because think about just this one guy has 150 million followers. How many of these followers he can, you know, bring onto the platform very, very quickly. So you're part of a new future, which we fuse uh, social media and blockchain technology together. Uh, is the highest user interaction worldwide. People already make video calls. Uh, they already make stories and reels all day long, but we are not getting paid for it. Now we can actually store everything uh, on the blockchain, have the, our data and private keys to our data, no censorships, no fake profile, and you can own your uh, friends and followers and referrals. You can own, own them in your uh, basically private key. When you refer to the pl platform, those referrals are your referrals and they're linked to you, okay? So that's a big part. Um, we have the social token, we have the brand token. Uh, so this is the benefit of Web3 and social media platform uh, that exists today. Now, I've done an interview uh, with the owners of uh, this uh, platform. 
So for those of you who have not seen this uh, interview yet, I just posted it uh, a couple hours ago. Um, it's about an hour long interview. You can gain a lot of insights uh, about it. And basically uh, everyone can right now, whoever invited you to the webinar, it's me or, or Peter or whoever invited you uh, today or you're watching this on replay, make sure that you grab the link uh, of who you want to uh, basically uh, connect to this platforms through, okay? And work with together or who invited you. And it's very simple to, uh, to connect. You connect with your MetaMask, you don't need to uh, verify anything. Right now on the stage, they do collect uh, the, the phone number, uh, but later on, when it's going to be all launched, they will not require any phone numbers, even when you connect to the social media, it's all Web3 and all through the wallet, okay? So uh, I encourage you to watch this interview that I've done with the founders. You'll learn a lot uh, about uh, this platform and what they are working on. and. Um, this is basically uh, uh, the main thing that I wanted to share with you. Now I open it to Q and A, and let's see what questions do you have. I am planning to bring the founders uh, on a webinar and uh, on an AMA session. Uh, I think it will happen on uh, uh, Monday because uh, Friday is not really a good day. People are on a weekend going some places, but uh, uh, we'll most likely do it next week on uh, on Monday. I'll make sure you know what time and you can also uh, ask the founders directly. So um, what questions you guys have? Let me know. Uh, you can unmute, uh, maybe Peter, you want to say a couple of words. Uh, what you got out of yourself from from the the main ideas from listening to the interview, um, what uh, what you can share? Yeah, so um, you know, I think from from hearing basically what what they have said with uh, Kendall and, and really what what the future has been, and and with one of the founders um, creating a, a a social network one month before facebook was even created uh in europe and you know doing well with that you know maybe um maybe one thing you can touch on vitaly is how uh the owners have actually had previous success and what their previous success has been maybe you could touch on that i think that would be helpful for people to understand uh i know that uh, robert wesker has uh, done four exits uh, profitably for the businesses he's built, including a social media platform that uh, he launched uh, one month before Facebook. And uh, he built it, uh, that was a long time ago, but uh, he always wanted to do something big with social media. And when cryptocurrency came along, uh, obviously, and smart contracts, that was more towards like 2017, 2018, this is the time where he started to search in for a partner. And he found uh, uh, Powell, uh, very ambitious, uh, successful, and young entrepreneur uh, in crypto space since 2012, basically mining Bitcoin all the way in 2012. Uh, self-educated about uh, many aspects of the crypto, including coding. So they kind of found a match of building this project together. They found that they can build this together, sharing similar values and visions. So 2019, this is when they started to uh, build uh, the Kandao. Uh, and uh, it went from, they, they monitor, they learn from what's working, what's not working, and they're been strategizing how to bring it to the market and launch it in the best way. So it's been in the works since 2019. 
uh, pretty much. And um, uh, right now we are in 2023. So they have a lot of the foundation already built. They solved a lot of the problems that they needed to solve. And they are ready to expand. They're ready to hire all these people that are required to make all the features they have in plan a reality. So right now there are like 20 or 30 uh, programmers uh, working. Like it's a, it's not a huge team like in Facebook. Uh, it, it is a startup, right? But we are talking about a, a pre-sale that can uh, bring uh, up to $75 million, um, which a, a good portion of that is of course going to go into the development, into the hiring, uh, a lot of the stuff that is much, much more required into hundreds uh, in order to build and support a multi-billion dollar user social media platform. So it's a big undertaking, uh, but I believe they have what it takes. They are willing to work hard for the next 10 years. Um, and uh, from talking to them, and you, you'll be able to hear them and ask them anything you want. I'll bring them on the webinar. We'll be able to see uh, basically uh, that they are very level-headed and they understand the challenges and they are uh, prepared for it. Um, let's see. Uh, I, I see some questions on the chat. Any lock-in period for CDO tokens? Yes. Uh, the lock-in period uh, is going to be uh, roughly like this, like in the, th in the first uh, token generation event, 10% of the CDO will be unlocked uh, on the token generation event. And after that, every week, something is going to be unlocked about 0 0.8 something percent. So it's like three and a half percent per month until all the uh, tokens will be unlocked to you. So if you do the calculation, how much 90% divided by um, 3.5 is basically 20, yeah, two years, like something like that. Uh, in two years, all the tokens will be unlocked, but they'll be unlocked every week, uh, a portion, like 0.8% of every week unlocked. Um, stake and unstake at any time? I believe so, but you can ask this question directly uh, on the, to the founders also. Um, where is the link to join and buy the coins? Uh, the link right now is available. Uh, who invited you to the webinar to connect your wallet. You cannot buy the coins yet. On the 6th of March, you can make a deposit and by making a deposit, you basically confirm that you are going to participate in the pre-sale. The pre-sale will start on the 20th of March. That's when you can actually buy uh, and participate in the pre-sale by getting the priority pass uh, right there from the 20th of uh, March. But from the 6th of March, you can already uh, kind of deposit and uh, by doing so, uh, you also uh, help your leader to qualify for uh, the ability to get the CDO token at a cheaper price. Uh, like I explained, in uh, uh, a limited uh, quantity, but it's very nice to be able to get the token as cheap as 2.8 cents or three cents or three and a half cents when you know that the token generation event will be at 21 cent. Mm -hmm. uh, what will be the minimum that can be purchased? I, I don't think it will be a, a minimum uh, for the purchase. Maybe a hundred dollar, I don't know, but nothing too crazy. Um, uh, priority pass, the minimum is 150, 150, dollars is the minimum. Um, is there a more simplified way for people to join Kandao like other social media like Facebook? Um, I mean, you can you download an app, 
you connect with your wallet and that's it. Uh, that's how you log in. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty simple. You have to understand that this is decentralized. And in order to make it decentralized, you have to use a DAP. You have to use a MetaMask. You have to use a trust wallet. You have to use a token pocket. You have to use some kind of DAP that has an internal browser or an extension attached to it. Because if it doesn't, then it's not, it's not going to work correctly. So that's how we keep this decentralized. And if it was centralized, then you wouldn't need a wallet to connect to anything. But that would make it you know, a little bit more difficult. I think one important thing to... Uh, to point out, Vitaly, and one important question to ask the founders when we have them is how will we, how can we make it so that there won't be an ability to actually duplicate another profile? Like, I understand that you have one person who's connected to that particular wallet, but let's put it this way no one's the smartest person in the room and there's so many other smarter people that are out there. And so how can we guarantee that safety for our community, for our following to make sure that that isn't happening? So I think that would be a really good thing for them to explain when we have them on, on a call. Yeah. Uh, like when somebody does a KYC, for example. Yeah. So even if they are linked uh, with a certain wallet uh, and this wallet is connected uh, to their NFT, their NFT doesn't change because it is linked to their identity. But if they lost a private key or they, 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 they want to connect and access to the platform with all of their followers with a different wallet uh, and because they have the full KYC and they can prove that this is who they are, uh, they'll be able to use a different, uh, let's say, uh, MetaMask wallet in order to connect to their NFT on-chain ID now. So they're, they're, they're already solved this type of a challenges that is uh, possible when people, let's say, lose their private keys, yeah? Uh, so to not lose all of this uh, content and everything else they've created, so there there must be solutions to to that. Yeah, uh, but definitely we can ask them more details about that uh, on the on the. Web. You have you have two people, uh, Gerald and Raphael, who have their hands up. So why don't we let them ask their questions, and then we'll close it out. Sure. Uh, cool, I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, one question I have is I have a lot of people that have a, a lot of intellectual properties. Um, I just want to make sure I wrap my head around what you're doing. I can have them join the system, sell their product or service as an NFT, and I would get paid because they're under me. Is that how it works? Uh, exactly. You will benefit. You'll earn a, a particular percentage uh, of that sale of that nft or all the activity on the social tokens that uh, people buy because you are the person that uh, referred uh, this person to the platform and it's not only this person but you'll be rewarded on a multi-level network of all these users that will come to the platform uh, so again th this this is not by the way, for clarification, it's not a multi-level marketing company, okay? It's different. You're not gonna see here uh, rank rewards uh, or, or rank recognition or any of that stuff because it's a, it's not about that at all. It's not a, a MLM company. It, it, mm -hmm. it has a, a concept called a multi-level network via different algorithms based on uh, who you are and how much you contribute uh, to the platform, like who, who are you bringing, how, how you participate. The algorithms are going to know how to reward you and in what way from all of the network that you bring. Maybe one of the network you bring is somebody like Elon Musk, you know? So 
if you bring somebody is super important, then of course you'll be uh, rewarded for that uh, because you, you bring a lot of value to, to the platform. Even if it's not you that brought in Elon Musk, maybe you brought someone and this someone brought someone and this someone connected to Elon Musk. So eventually it's because of you it led, right? So basically uh, they, they will have all these algorithms, it's very complicated, but uh, to, to program it and to actually, uh, you know, to, to pinpoint exactly like, it's not as simple as, okay, this is the percentage you're going to get. It's more complicated than that. But the idea is that you are going to benefit on multiple levels from all of the transaction fees and from all of the activities from all of your network. So whatever you build right now connected to your crypto wallets uh, is basically can serve you for years to come. Uh, if this platform goes to billions of users, you know, after the first million users, those million will bring the billion, you know, the, those first people there, why they're going to bring people in because they are incentivized. They're going to be paid directly in their wallets for all of this activity. So they, all these people will be incentivized to, hey, why, why you use Facebook, you know, use this because you'll get paid and it will go on and on and influencers will see, oh, I can earn this. One influencer will earn a lot of money to another influencer and it can become quite viral, quite fast, you know? So um, it, it is- So, it is so the next question is, will it, will it depend on the contract that is written or is it already set in place as to how much percentage that uh, I would get for said people going in my network? Uh, no, it's not, it's not that simple as uh, already set in stone percentages. It cannot work like this because it's, it's different types of algorithms that will determine uh, exactly how much each person is going to pay. Maybe they're going to pay 10% fee. Maybe they're going to pay 50% fee. It depends on a lot of factors. So, but from all these transactional fees and people will pay those fees because they generate money from the platform. They, they generate maybe capital if they're a project owner, if they do a launch pad or their social token, if they benefit from it. I mean, if you are have your social token, wouldn't you buy your own token first? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Absolutely. like, like uh, because you can buy it at the cheapest price possible because uh, it, you're the very first one that buys. So everybody else that will see this token, they can buy. The price can only go up and it can never go below what you purchase it because you purchase it first. So, of course, you're benefiting from uh, believing in yourself and, uh, you know, you have the incentive to uh, promote your own social token, your own, like, this is your own value or it's your own network, your own market cap, your holders, all of that, uh, you have a direct incentive. So you'll be gladly paying those fees because you earn way, way more money. So all those mm -hmm. fees are going to be shared uh, with, with network. Thank you so much. Yeah, you, you're welcome. You're welcome. Awesome. I have another question for you. Yes. So I heard you say that there are no free tokens in the ecosystem, not on the CDO side. Uh, when when these individuals create their own token, they will have to buy their own just like all of us as well. There will be no free tokens given out, no free airdrops, things like that, correct? Uh, I believe so, yeah, that people will, will need to whatever they want, yeah. Uh, but they don't have they, they they will not have to basically if they don't want to. But you know, people other people buy your own social token. If you don't hold basically nothing, how will you benefit <laughs> from other people buying your token? You know, right. Well, that's what I'm saying is they they won't have an option to have. Uh, let's just say for an easy number, a million tokens uh, that they that they create and they keep half of them for themselves. So that when the other half of them sell, they they have the the majority, right? Yeah, basically the way that they are gonna do it is to to not allow uh, for too much complication. They, they want to simplify things. 
So if you want to attract the regular person that is going to do it, if you start teaching about them, you know, tokenomics and uh, how many tokens you want to produce, and I mean, so many different things, then it's going to be very hard and complicated for everyone. But if you make this process super simple, like a couple of clicks, boom, boom, and you're done. So everybody can do it in a simple way. And uh, uh, you can ask this question on AMA directly to them, like explain, can you explain more, more detail of how this social token uh, launch, uh, like, I mean, the creation process is going to be, so they'll be able to explain it better uh, from a technical standpoint. Um, they, there's going to be like a burn curve smart contract, what they explain in the interview where uh, it works oh, like an is. ATM so people can buy and sell, uh, interacting directly with the smart contract and uh, the solving the issue of the liquidity also with this because you don't need to now have like liquidity pools that you start attracting it becomes complicated, but uh, using certain types of uh, smart contracts, uh, all of this liquidity can be automated and, and people interact with a smart contract. Uh, so basically, um, as I understand it, in order for you to benefit from your own social token, you will need to buy some of it um, because you, cool. you will hold it. <laughs> but you'll buy right. it. And that's what I wanted to know so that it takes, it takes the uh, rug pool type scenario out of the situation if they don't if they're not able to accumulate without spending their own money too so i, I definitely of like course. that yeah yeah of course and uh, every time of course they do it there is some fees associated with this so we all benefit <laughs> uh, from it so there is a big potential uh you know for for a very good um, passive income you know what one of my friends who knows them like he knows powell uh, barinsky is uh, one of the founders uh, for nine years and i was having dinner with him today he's a uh, very you know uh, basically a uh, early uh, believer in in the in the project and uh, he says he, he said to me that he believes in a few years, each CDO can produce one to two dollars per year in the, in passive income, um, which which is uh, huge, you know. Uh, let's say you have four, you know, a hundred thousand CDOs. So a hundred thousand CDOs, if you participate, let's say at five cents how much uh, how much you spent for that um five thousand dollars right if if you get it five cents five thousand dollars so if you're able to generate one dollar per year in passive rewards just for holding and staking those cdos because of all the advertising revenue all of these different things it's a hundred thousand dollar a year passive income for as you participated five thousand at the beginning so that's uh that's huge um they do plan to have a live event i know uh towards the uh you know the more of the token generation event i think in the summer maybe in september i don't know uh, but after all of this pre-sale will pass this is where the games just begins because all of these people are now connected to you they uh, we're going to be launching uh, the, the app will be launched everything is live uh the first uh, version of it right and uh, and basically um you can already start to see uh, the revenue come in and once everything is fully developed you can have potentially millions of people already in your network. That's where the bigger money comes in. Now, what, what we can make in the next few months uh, is 
what we can make short term, but what we can make long term residually can be much, much, much higher because that's where what that's where the big residual income comes in uh, for from the growth of the social media platform. So their their goal is very, very big. They they want to be at the level of uh, billions of users. Um, and and they are prepared to hire as many people as needed, you know, and and to go through all this all this process to uh, to build it into the the phenomena of marketplace for everything and 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 really having this whole economy where everybody can tokenize themselves <laughs> uh, and uh, and uh, all the benefits that comes with social media platform that is decentralized so. When people finally realize, you know, there's so many, so much talk was about Facebook controlling the data, they're listening to everything and, you know, and uh, basically selling this data and uh, they they know about you more than you think. <laughs> so I think with the advance of the blockchain, it's time we fuse those things together and uh, maybe they'll have their own blockchain in the future. It's, Right now, they start with uh, Polygon and Binance Smart Chain and uh, Ethereum. They start with those three blockchains. Um, and uh, it should be good enough for the for the start. Now, I, I don't say and they don't say that they deny that maybe in future they will work on their own blockchain and develop their own blockchain. Uh, right now, that's not the main focus of them. They don't want to work on their own blockchain. They want to focus on uh, the application layer, like building application, 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 utility. And uh, and after that, at some point, they might decide to uh, have their own blockchain. Uh, so uh, this is like so early on. Uh, the ability to build a network in in these rules, uh, like like we have right now, uh, it started like ten days ago. So it, it's very very early on that we are right now. And yeah, it's 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 really huge. Um, so I know it's one thirteen there. I know Rafael's had his hand up. Uh, so we'll let him ask his question, and then we'll call it a day. Sure. Okay. Thank you very much. Can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Uh, my question is this. I raised a question about uh, how the platform can be more simplified. I'm speaking right now from Nigeria, West Africa. Uh, I've created my own group and uh, following up with people, a couple of individuals did not understand the, 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 the decentralized uh, blockchain, talking about MetaMask, talking about uh, other decentralized action like Trust Wallet, a couple of people do not know. People that know that even have it, they find it difficult to connect. I have about 12 members so far in my team, only three have been able to connect. So my question is this, being a social media, people are already familiar with the like of Facebook, Instagram, and the like. Now, this does not really have any direct link to the blockchain. Can there be a kind of a holding tank for people to come in, join, and uh, later on they migrate fully into having their own, uh, uh, what is it called, uh, linking their account to the like of a decentralized exchange like a MetaMask and the Trust Wallet, oh, yeah. so that they can participate. I I, I forgot mm -hmm. to tell you that uh, 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 everyone will be able to easily invite their friends and followers from Facebook and Instagram. Uh, okay. from their app from the app uh, itself okay. like when the when they log in so all of this you know uh, google and uh, and facebook and instagram so there will be an integration uh, okay. so there, there there will be connection between kandao and this platform so you can easily onboard people uh, okay. from facebook and instagram to kandao okay okay um let me let me share with you couple of uh, uh, so you have the idea uh, of how it's gonna look like uh, so one second 
Yeah, yeah, we'll do this real quick and then close out because I actually have another appointment. Okay. So you can see right here. This is a one. This is the pre-sale actually of the priority passes. We have everything paid in USDC. Um, direct bonus and team bonus here. Okay. Then uh, uh, we're talking about uh, here uh, your domains. Okay. Whatever your domains are, the, the Web3 domains. Uh, the wallet, you can see the assets here. You can hold your uh, anything you want, different, different tokens and coins. Okay. You see here active rewards, passive rewards, and affiliate commissions, on chain profile. You can define the roles. You have the friends, followers, referrals, your social token. Um, this is how your page gonna look. You know, you see friends, friends of friends, the price, the holders, market cap, supply, price changes, common friends. Uh, what is your roles? Follow. Uh, what's your balance? All of that stuff. Uh, social media. You can see LinkedIn, Instagram, Facebook right here. Uh, NFTs. Kandao uh, Heroes is their NFT collection. Uh, the ability to verify what he he worked uh, where this is like the view of the uh, like the stories yeah and this is the discovery of uh, different people and their market caps and their prices and <laughs> this is pretty exciting um, you see like a person who who he is a developer youtuber product manager designer UX expert, artist, etc. What's the supply? What's the market cap? What's, how many holders? What's the price? What's the changes in price? Connect to social media. Connect to Facebook, LinkedIn, Google, Instagram. Um, uh, people in real life, like let's say you have an off-chain New York City crypto drinks uh, offline meeting, so you can see where it's happening and how to get there with, via the map. Every single uh, the, the app requires invitation code. Yeah. Um, some more examples. Is the app ready now? The app is in review in, on the on the app store right now. So, okay. So can one download it now? Uh, not yet. It's on the review. Okay. 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 That is good. Yeah. Hey, Vitaly. Um, one last thing. Thank you. you. Can you do me a favor after showing all those pictures? Um, can you just send me uh, screenshots of all those pictures so we could upload it into our group? Sure, sure, sure. I'll send. All right. Thanks, buddy. I got to run. Thanks so much for doing this. Okay. So, yeah, let's prop it up. Thanks, Peter. Thanks, Molly. Thank you. And thank you. Thank you for being here. And we'll going to be doing more webinars. And um uh, uh next week just be on the lookout and i'm gonna bring the founders and be able to ask them directly uh and we'll do uh, uh more amas uh during the next uh, months uh or so and uh, of course when when everything going to be uh, like i'll give you as much updates as possible uh for everything so um they're here and um, they are in Dubai, so uh, if you are happening to to be here in Dubai and you are uh, you know very serious about this, then uh, I can potentially organize a meeting also with you with the founders. So um, thank you for for being here, guys, and uh, I wish all of us a huge success. Um, and uh, we'll see you in the next uh, sessions. Everyone, right? Thank now, you. You can all get started for free, uh, building your network and uh, getting people ready for uh, for the launch. Okay. So. All right. I will see you soon. Okay. Welcome back, guys. Hopefully, you found that entertaining and inspirational to share uh, what uh, the Vitali and uh, Peter and other leadership uh, of. Uh, got together with the founders and uh, 
that'll be coming up soon. So in the next few days, we will be putting up uh, uh, the uh, up and coming of the interview with the founders. Uh, so look forward to that. And uh, if you have any questions, please comment and please go ahead and subscribe, smash that bell. And we look forward to being able to uh, bring you more about Kadan and how this is a, an amazing decentralized platform that will allow you to uh, basically uh, create your own asset, your own token, uh, and, and uh, basically have your own economy all on the blockchain, uh, connected to the blockchain and sharing into the uh, the adverts and the marketing that the uh, the, the the social media will uh, be putting out there. So look forward to connecting more uh, in this wonderful world of web free, uh, crypto, DeFi, and decentralized technology. Have a great day, guys. Bye for now. And one word below, you will find a link to be able to join. Go ahead and join if you know how to use MetaMask. If you don't know how to use MetaMask or another crypto wallet, uh, give us a shout out and we can steer in our right place. But you can look it up on uh, YouTube and or any other social media and find out how to connect uh, MetaMask wallet and to be able to get in and join very early in this process of uh, this development before they unleash uh, the first uh, cycle which is uh, due for around june july and but between now and then this is a great platform to be able to connect uh, get your own digital signature prepared before others uh, get your digital signature so once your name is taken, you won't be able to, you'll have to, uh, if your name is uh, Billy Blob, uh, and there's many Billy Blobs out there, and your name gets taken tomorrow, well, that's too bad. You'll have to go Billy Blob number one or two or three or so forth. So hopefully that explains things, guys. Make sure you go down below in the uh, description to get the uh, uh, the the link. To be able to join, go ahead and join. Uh, it's free right now. And to be able to get plugged into this uh, an amazing community of decentralized social media world where nothing is taken down and nothing is stolen from you. Uh, everything is equipped for you to become a true asset.